And I feel like infidelity, definitely infidelity. Tori Hart has stirred up some controversy again, and the internet is buzzing with excitement. The ex-wife of Kevin Hart has defied the saying, let sleeping dogs lie and dug up the past, which is set to rock the boat of the comedian's family. What did Tori Hart say? And how is it affecting the comedian's new home? Tori Hart has opened up on her past marriage with Kevin, detailing how they met, the ups and downs of their marriage, and how Kevin started ignoring her when he became famous. According to Tori, she held Kevin down while he had nothing and helped build his career into the celebrated phenom he is today. The couple were blessed with two children, Kevin and Hendrix, during their seven-year marriage, which ended in 2010. Though the couple cited irreconcilable differences as the official reason for their divorce, many sources claimed that it was because Kevin cheated. According to the sources, Tori would have forgiven the ride-along star if he cheated only once or twice. However, the comedian had apparently done it so often that Tori couldn't find the strength to forgive or the room in her heart to accommodate her ex-husband's indiscretions. Thus, she chose the path that would bring her peace and closure, which was divorce. Kevin Hart himself has admitted to cheating on his wife in some of his comedic routines, much to the chagrin of Tori. Yes, people, I cheated. Am I ashamed of it? No. No, I'm not. Do I wish that I could take it back? No. No, I don't. Torre, who appears to be tired of that routine, once quipped, I have an ex-husband who has repeatedly used me in his stand-up routines. For years, I had to endure that. Torre has maintained her composure and self-respect for the sake of her kids, and has decided not to lash out at the comedian in public or drag him on social media. However, many fans claim all is not well between the former couple, and that Torre appears to be harboring some form of resentment towards Kevin and his new wife. Interestingly, Torre has admitted she doesn't really like Enico Parrish, and if given the opportunity, she would teach her a few lessons on fidelity. I never laughed out. I never tried to punch her in the face, even though I've had moments where trust and believe. Well, now, sources claim that Torre Hart has purportedly revealed the list of women she suspects Kevin Hart had an affair with while they were still married. People who claim to have seen the list mention Kevin Hart's current wife, Enico Parrish, as the first on the list. Curiously, Eniko gave herself away when she mentioned in a social media post that she'd been together with Kevin for eight years when the comedian was only divorced for six. On the 13th of August, 2017, Kevin Hart and his new wife took to social media to celebrate one year of marriage. The Get Hard star wrote, Happy one year anniversary to this unbelievable wife of mine. Thank her for all that you do. Thank you for loving me and supporting me at the highest level. Thank you for loving and embracing my kids. Thank you for turning my house into a home. Thank you for simply making me happy. You are and will forever be my reb. Point one year down and the rest of our life to go. Our family and our union is getting bigger and stronger and I love it. However, Eniko's heartfelt message ratted her out. She wrote, when it's real, no love or bond can ever be faked nor broken. My partner in life, my other half that makes me whole, my soulmate. Thank you for always keeping a smile on my face. I love you more every day. Eight years together, one year married, forever to go. Happy one year anniversary, babe. We made it. However, eagle-eyed commenters saw Eniko's apparent slip and called her out for wrecking Torre Hart's home. Eniko fought back, indicating that Torre and her husband were separated for two years, each partner living in different houses. So, she didn't break any home but instead laid the blame squarely at the feet of Torre Hart for her failed marriage. She insisted that the rumors were spread by Torre herself and called on her to take responsibility for her actions in the failed marriage. Eniko then dropped another bombshell. She claimed that there were many other women in Kevin's life besides her, but Torre targeted her because she clicked with Kevin. Torre also replied, insisting they were still together, living under the same roof when Eniko made her way into Kevin Hart's life. She said, Eniko, sweetheart, normally I don't feed into this, but when you addressed me, you forced my hand to respond. We have made successful strides to become a loving co-parenting family, but you have now left it open for my character to be questioned. You, Kevin, and I know the truth. Torre then said Kevin Hart would do the same to Eniko, and true to her words, the comedian cheated on Eniko when she was seven months pregnant, which we'll come to later. Aside from Eniko, Kevin Hart is rumored to have dated Nastasha Smith. According to the grapevine, the pair met in 2010, but many believe it was just a fling and nothing serious. Nastasha, who was a cast member of Love & Hip Hop, has allegedly dated other guys in the industry, according to her once good friend Nia Riley. On one of the Love & Hip Hop episodes, Nastasha posted a picture of Nia with her baby. Nia didn't appreciate that unsolicited gesture and confronted Nastasha. 
That was when Nia spilled all the tea. According to Nia, Nastasha had slept with half the men in the industry, including Matt Kemp, Sean Kingston, Bo Wow, and Kevin Hart. She insinuated that Nastasha would sleep with any man who breathed and moved and that she was cheap. Fans saw Nia's statement as confirmation of their long-held suspicion. After all, Nia Riley was once close to Nastasha and thus was privy to whatever happened in her life. Nastasha and Hart haven't denied the rumors or Nia's claims, serving as fuel, fire up the rumors. Though several sources place Kevin Hart and Nastasha's relationship in 2012, a year after Kevin's divorce, fans believe the pair's relationship goes further than that. Another woman Kevin Hart might have dated while he was still with Torre Hart was Jessica Marquez, known as Simply Jess. Simply Jess is an American adult and glamour model who operates her own line of skincare products. In 2012, a picture of the model in the company of Tyrese Gibson and Kevin Hart hit the internet after the celebrities hosted a party at Cameo Nightclub in Miami Beach, Florida. Soon, rumors started swelling that the comedian was in bed with the model, which wasn't surprising. Simply Jess is notorious for hooking up with several celebrities in the industry, including Bo Wow, Chris Brown, Trey Songz, and Omarion. Curiously, both parties didn't deny rumors, which many fans interpreted as confirming their assumptions. It is believed that Simply Jess and Kevin Hart only had a fling and nothing serious, as they were rarely seen together after the incident in Miami Beach. Interestingly, Eniko Parrish, Kevin Hart's current wife, has faced her own karma, as many fans like to put it. In 2017, a video circulated on the internet showing a man, who many assumed to be the comedian, getting cozy with a woman in bed. Soon, social media started buzzing with rumors that Kevin Hart was cheating on his wife of one year. To make matters worse, the ride-along actor had posted a picture of Eniko on social media that same weekend he cheated on her. Kevin then took to social media to apologize to his wife amidst claims that someone tried to blackmail him before the video made it to the public domain. According to him, the person demanded $10 million to keep the video a secret. However, his refusal to pay up caused the leakage of the said video, which got many people talking on social media. According to sources, Kevin Hart went to Las Vegas that that weekend to wind down when he met Montia Sabag, the woman at the center of the controversy. Many fans started suspecting Sabag as the one who tried to set up Kevin Hart and extort money from him. However, Sabag denied the rumors, insisting that she was as much of a victim as Kevin Hart was. Later, her lawyer also repeated Sabag's statement and urged Kevin Hart to team up with her client to find the perpetrator. However, in the twist of events, Sabag made a U-turn and sued Kevin Hart for the incident. According to the model, Kevin and his former friend JT Jackson set her up by planting the camera at the places where she met the comedian. Sabag sued Kevin Hart for $60 million in hopes of reaping some profits from the whole scandal. However, her suit was immediately thrown out of court simply because she filed at the wrong place. This turn of events made many fans suspect that Sabag was the one who set Kevin Hart up to make money off of him. They wondered why Kevin would set her up, knowing she had little fame and less money than he did. Fans concluded that Sabag's suit didn't make sense. Hence, she could be the person behind the extortion attempt on Kevin Hart. However, all this drama took a toll on Eniko Parrish, who was then heavily pregnant with their first son, Kenzo Cash. According to Eniko, she found out when someone sent her a video of her husband's indiscretion to her DM. Tears started rolling rolling down her tears as she watched how her husband got cozy with another woman in a club in bed. She recounted how she sunk into depths of despair and despondency as the video kept playing. They sent me an edited video of Kevin and you know, another woman, his wife narrated. I opened my phone and immediately I just lost it. I called him, I'm crying, I'm like pissed. Right then and there, I kept saying, how the F did you let that happen? Aniko decried how the entire affair was on social media and cautioned her husband to desist from such acts, or she'd advise herself. You publicly humiliated me. Your whole everything's on Instagram. Everything's on social media. It was an ongoing fight all the time. Every single day, she said. I kept questioning him like, if this is what you're going to do, I don't want to be a part of that. Aniko's pain could be felt through the screen as she explained how she felt when the news broke. However, some fans felt karma was paying her back for wrecking Tori Hart's home. They reminded her of how she sneaked into Kevin's life when he was still married to Tori and how she boasted about it on social media. Fans also reminded her of Tori's prediction that Kevin would do what she did to her. After all, a leopard doesn't change its spots. They asserted that if Kevin could cheat on his wife of seven years, 
what wouldn't he do to his wife of only one year? However, the Jumanji star claimed that the hardest part of the whole ordeal was looking his wife in the eye and confessing his deeds. He claimed that the whole ordeal destroyed him internally, as he could see how hurt his wife was. That conversation, there is no easy way to have that conversation, Hart said. The worst part was just knowing how you made somebody feel. There's a major effect it could have on the people that you are closest to, who you love the most. When I got to see that firsthand with Aniko when I got to see the effect my reckless behavior had, it was crazy crushing. That tore me up. That really tore me up. Kevin Hart apologized for his mishap and promised not to allow the incident to repeat itself. According to him, he had a deep conversation with his wife, where he promised to take measures to ensure he didn't find himself in that kind of situation again. Eniko then said she believed in second chances and was willing to give their marriage a second try. On why she stayed even though her husband allegedly had a history of cheating on his wife, Eniko pointed to her son Kenzo. She affirmed her love for her husband but cautioned him that he only had three strikes, and it was over between them. She then admonished her husband to put on his best behavior if he wanted to be in her life and that of their children. However, Kevin appears to have broken his promise already and made the second or probably the third strike. It all started when Hart's former assistant, Mia Shakes, granted an interview with Latasha Kibi, where she alleged that her former boss was cheating on his wife. According to Latasha, the alleged incident happened in his office, and she even informed Eniko about it. After clips of the interview surfaced on social media, Kevin filed a suit against Tasha and Shakes, alleging that the two ladies tried to extort him. According to the suit, the ladies demanded $250,000 to prevent them from airing the interview. However, Hart refused to pay, and instead engaged the police to issue a cease and desist letter to the ladies. According to the suit, publishing the bombshell interview would constitute a violation of the NDA between Hart and Shakes, making her liable for prosecution. However, since Shakes broke the NDA agreement and went ahead to post the video, she has opened up herself for a lawsuit. The suit also stated that Shakes made false and defamatory comments against her former boss and other legal cases he was involved in. According to the suit, some of the false statements Shakes made indicated that Hart recorded an S encounter with a lady, which subjected him to criminal charges. The comedian is suing the two ladies for civil extortion and the public disclosure of private facts. He is also suing Shakes for defamation and breach of contract, while Kebe faces intentional interference with contractual relations. According to the lawsuit, KB has an established history of posting defamatory and otherwise improper content regarding celebrities. The whole brouhaha barely died down when Eniko Hart made a cryptic post that fans interpreted to mean that her husband was indeed cheating. Taking to her Instagram handle, Eniko posted, The level of IDGF I reached this year is crazy. Fans thought that Eniko was tired of her husband's alleged indiscretion and had given up on him. One fan wrote, Law witty that midget done cheated again sis. One person joked. As another said, Kevin's still cheating, I see. However, others were not surprised at the turn of events, as one claimed. How you got him is how you'll lose him, sis. For now, we are waiting for the outcome of the suit he filed against Mia Shakes and Latasha Kebe. Hopefully, the verdict will let us know whether Kevin Hart cheated on Eniko Parrish or nah. And that'll be all for today. Thanks for watching. See you in the next episode.